Hello and welcome to part 16 of Rosso Plays Cyberpunk. Um, well, we're still grinding street cred, still grinding my level up to at least 18 so I can wear my uh, cop outfit. And in the meantime, I don't look too bad, I don't think. I'm not overloaded with armadillo mods or anything. Got reasonable stats. So let's have a wander around Chinatown and see what's what. I think that sounds like fun. Just get my headphones on and then we'll get cracking. Oh. Okay. Yeah, we'll head off to, we're gonna leave Judy at the moment and Takamera alone. We'll save that for another one. And here we're just gonna grind to get some of these blue Blues and gigs done. So let's go and see what this one is first of all. Maybe learn a little bit more about Johnny. No, we're going for the gig first. Go for the gig first. Okay. Place is beautiful. I've seen the outfits. Yeah, I know there's clones in some places, but uh, I tell you, what the hell? I'm just not seeing that much of it. Jordan Walker. Kimp mask. Do I, know you? I don't think so. Nope. Let's go back to this uh, quest. Back on track. Into Cherry Blossom Market. What really happened at Arasoka Tower? I'm sure I've read that. Hey, hey, V, wait a sec. Listen to that guy. How'd you read his chops? Hmm. Weak amateur hour? Mm, pathetic. You can barely hold the thing. I ain't a musician, but even I can tell that sloppy stuff. Ladies and gentlemen, a critic. Chill, Chumba. Ain't half bad. Guys hurt me. Got something he can't take. How does he tune those strings? Could stand a little more stage presence. Fingering's all wrong, loses the tempo. Gotta get your fingering right. Not bad. Really know how to give a guy a compliment. That how you got your star? Street busker with big dreams. Don't make me laugh. No time for playing my way to the top. Was too busy shaking the world awake. Being at the top can be worth it. Want to shake the world, you know? The world's got to feel you first. And you pay for it. You spend your lyrics laying waste to the big record corpse. Who's going to sign you then? But give up your ideals, and no amount of eddies can buy them back. All right, princess. At least you played some gigs. Saw those memories of yours. True. Played where we could. Parks, old factories, underground clubs. Had an audience from the start. Some recorded our stuff, didn't even know who we were. You were part of the system from the start. So, you're saying some old samurai bootlegs are still floating around town? I smell heads. No idea you were such a materialist. Could almost cry. I'm not gonna say I'm a fan. Chokes aside. I think those tapes still exist after all these years. Oh, I should have said I was a fan. You know, Rainbow that not being full was a materialistic club you played till the band fell apart. Great spot, place for people with their heads on straight. Maybe they'll know something. Perhaps the Warsaw Catholic faith had its origin. As Saint Augustine of Hippo taught us to err is human, but to err willingly 
is to perform work of Satan. Pope Ferdinand I and his successors are guilty of this heinous sin for their perversion of Christ's teaching and their worship of the golden calves of technology and mammon. They have not only chosen this path to perdition for themselves, but have attempted to tempt the Lord's flock to follow. For the sake of the millions of eternal souls who love so dearly, Cardinal Comrade Lewandowski made the only decision God would allow. Seeing that the Vatican had renounced our Lord and Saviour, he rescinded his nomination to head the Holy See, and instead rested the weight of the newly founded Polish papacy, papacy on his shoulders and moved the seat of the church to Lichten in Poland. What do Warsaw Catholics believe? Warsaw Catholics worship the one true God and recognise family as defined by the laws of nature. Our Lord has provided and in accordance with the traditions hallowed by the blood of our ancestors. When you say I believe in God, what do you mean? It means we acknowledge the truth that there is but one true God whose wisdom is infinite and unchanging, who commands our obedience, who compels us to raise a families founded on love and truth, who has tested Poland with great suffering as he tested Job, thus demonstrating that Poland is God's chosen land. Oh, you blokes that code red, I'm sure had great fun writing this. <laughs> Through whom did God reveal what we are to believe? This only Son, Jesus Christ, whose earthly voice is now spoken through the Pope, as elected by the Polish Episcopal Conference. Jesus wept. That would be an ecumenical matter. Why believe the word of God? Because only through faith can we be saved and find eternal peace in heaven. Only through faith can we be true Poles, worshipping, thinking and speaking in Polish in accordance with the customs of our fathers and mothers. <laughs> Advertising just to control the people. I'm sure that's all religion really was. Just another form of control. More lies. Um, Johnny? Pretty sure they turned your great spot into a slurp shop. Mindless fucking consumerism wins the day again. Yeah. Wait for the other team. Huh. This is why you don't bring back fallen warriors. Capitalism has no love of the Sooner art. Or later they're gonna see everything they fought for is turned to shit. Unless it's for advertising. Or tax dodging. Provides 330% of recommended daily vitamins. Hey. Rainbow Cadenza ain't anything real. Oh no, another one. Aren't you too young for this? To what now? Dad drum by in his old leather comes in here. Asks where is his old rainbow club. And I'm like a broken record. Tell all of them that the court broke them out 20 years ago. I should pass. Know anything about bootlegs from the Rainbow Cadenza days? Like say Samurai stuff. I can barely hear him. Wouldn't happen to know where I could find him? You can find him living back in the twenty twenties. <laughs> but besides that. Out there. Kaboom! Soy is still machistador! An explosion of chase! I hate advertising in general. What's he selling? Organic strawberries and cream. What do you think? Yeah, bootleg, okay. No one's heard of a single one of them. Cream. Thanks. Hmm. Hey. Oh. Hmm, <laughs> booze. They've got an awful lot of booze for a calf. I'm ready. You're ready? 
Okay. Let's go and buy us some of Johnny's tapes. Heard I can get some decent tunes here. What you mean by decent? We got Cartesian Duelist, Uridine stuff, Tainted Overlord. Any samurai? Kid, you even got an ass? Never fade away. Dancing with my axe, chipping in, you name it, we got it. Silverhand was the one true messiah of rock. I'd hand them records out like candy if I could. But a guy's gotta eat. Mm. See, I found Silverhand's biggest fan. And proud of it. I hear you. Bitty box rockers can't even touch it. Silverhand had something they couldn't even touch. Uh, Silverhand? <laughs> he had that fire kit. Say what you fire. see. Guy shook the foundations of the corporal world. He died for his ideals. Doesn't matter, he was also kind of a terrorist. Yeah. Blaze way down the rebel path. Now yeah, looking for the real deal. Like, say, bootlegs from Samurai's first gigs? Fuck. First, you have got no idea what you're asking for. Uh, Not if you're so, so chilled about Just it. asked, didn't I? Don't know how you found out about them bootlegs, but forget it. I'm not gonna give them to the first gunk off the street. What's the point of having merchandise you don't want to sell? I remember the gigs. I know what Johnny's last words to Kerry were. Know everything there is to know about Silverhand. Go on. Impress me. Know what he told Carrie the last time they met. Fuck this band. Not your crowd, not your noise. Do your own thing. Yeah, sure. I could think of a million conversations they had. There were no witnesses. Mm. Ah, I used to come here back when it was still Rainbow Cadenza. Bootleg sure would make a nice souvenir of the good old days. Cut the scop. You're too young to remember the first samurai gigs. Weren't even a twinkle near daddy's Kuroshis. Hey, appearances can be deceiving. <laughs> How do you know this pretty face ain't an implant? All right. Proof. How'd Samurai's third ever gig end? Ooh, it'll help Johnny. Hey, Johnny. Get your digital ass out here. Feed me my lines. How about this? Fuck you, V. Ain't your stupid sidekick. I need a sidekick. Well, Jackie's not here. Oh, for crying out loud. Fuck Johnny. Fucking hell, Johnny. Why the sabotage? Why now? Because it's funny. Because I'm bored. Maybe I don't like the cut of your conformist chip. You always freeze up like this? I'm busy. Shush. Played our third gig at Cadenza. Little fire broke out. Some drunk gonks tried to put it out with beer. Denny's fro got singed. Wore a wig for a few weeks. Never did get herself any tech hair. Hang on. Now I remember. Uh, there was a uh, fire. Poor Denny. Poor Denny's hair. <laughs> I almost forgot. Her Johnny started it actually. Tossed a sig that was still going. <laughs> Bullshit. That sig was Carrie's, no doubt. But hey, any troubles, Johnny's fault. <laughs> still don't believe you were there. But what the hell? I get you, Johnny. Only a real fan to know something like that. Hey, anyways, gotta educate the youth. Maybe you'll find something special under the table. Maybe. Huh. Show me the goods. Second conflict flight jacket. Tempting. Pair of shades. A samurai combat turtleneck. Uh, I don't think that is. That's more one of vintage samurai strong weave t shirt. That's a nice looking one, isn't it? Oh, oh that four slot. No, I don't want it. I don't want to be some sort of groupie. I'm not having it. I'll buy this. I'm not being a groupie. Not uh, not that I don't like Johnny. It's more I'm not going to be a sycophant. 
Much appreciated. Take it. Spread the good silver hand word. You know, they say time is the best teacher. Used to think that was true. But look at that guy. 60 at least, but still living in 2020. Guy's your biggest fan. Not happy to meet him? Usaka Tower to smithereens, and it's still standing there. Just the same. Don't want people getting stuck in a rut, stuck in the past. Want them to change, them and the world. Something's got to have changed. In 60 years. Something must have changed. You know what changed? The damn facade. Fresh interface plugs, new high fructose scop syrup, and fun fruity flavors. A new face of Arasaka, same old shit. Different package. Oh, Johnny. Something's changing. Maybe we can't see it, but there's change all the same. Sure. Now almost nobody remembers when a person wasn't just a meat bag full of secondhand implants. True. Okay. Let's go to the police job. I like Johnny. He's a cool kid. This is like somewhere I should be walking. 125. Maybe there. Okay. Okay. Round here. Hmm. Yeah, Oops. Right you replace your legs. <laughs> I wasn't looking where I was going. Yet have nowhere to run. You replace your heart. Yet you feel nothing. Hello. You've come to believe in coin as the ultimate solution. To any problem. That's right, capitalism but is your new god. Within you, billions of euro dollars could not fill. I hear ya. Okay, one, two, three. Three people. Yo, something hit me. Something hit me hard. Ow. What the hell hit me? I wish I knew. I'll have to watch out in case it happens again. They totally wiped me out. That was insane how fast I died. So some nades. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I don't know what happened there. Another one gone. Two more left. You lot didn't want to be disturbed, did you? I saw Suzuki. Got eyes on O'Brien. Send him my luck. Stay there. Don't let him out of your sight. Sure, having dinner with the wife and kid. Probably be there a while. Alright, our chums will be there in a sec. When do I get the eds? Promise me. 
Since when do snitching losers get paid, huh? Since when? But but I helped you. That was that was supposed to be a reward. Well, okay, I don't need it. I don't want any trouble. I'm fucking with you, Chum. <laughs> You'll get your heads. Don't worry. Ah, <laughs> sorry, totally got me. Ooh. Another Joe Taro. Take those earrings off you. And those. Okay. That wasn't me, I didn't kill her. I don't think it was me. At least, I'm pretty sure it wasn't me. Oh, a hat. Maybe I'll give that a go. Con I may. Good hit for you, Oliver O'Brien. Guy's a guard at a Militech prison. Protects bigs. That snitching little bitch who fucked over our boys. And you know what to do with snitches and bitches who protect them. Yeah, snitches get uh, murdered. Anyway, Olivier goes. Biggs loses protection he's spotting solidarity. Then Bradley Costigan. Costigan. Our uh, inside tomb got his hands on him. Simple, better be. Simple, better be. Costigan. Ah, yes, that's not the name of a brand of uh, thrush cream. At all. That's different. My bad. Okay. That was pretty harsh though. Let's eat some food and get back on it. To the map, I think. And now we will head here. Search and recover. A client wants you to find something here. Let's go and see what this is. God damn those adverts. The um, staff at CDPR, they'd spent ages creating these adverts and brands and things like that and they had a really good time doing it and I bet they did, heaven's sake. Baldy dog. What are they trying to sell? Proud to use Easy Beef. Is it dog food they're trying to sell? Cans of processed yuck. There's a lot to be said about going vegetarian in today's world of processed muck. Amazing clothes they're wearing. Is it night or am I just undercover? I don't think I'm just undercover. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Greed never pays. B, I need you to acquire something. Only me, no client. So I expect quick and clean results. Okay. You will be entering Tiger Claw territory. Very high risk. More information attached. Search and recover. We have a guard. See what's in the front door, shall we? Now, if I take that, he's going to attack me. I know that. that you know, you can't just pick up these personal tokens and go. I'd never allow it. Hey, yep. What's on the computer? Messages. Hey, Jim. Heating guy was here. Went on about a pressure issue. Saying there's a leak, then set up some sacker folding. That was the last I saw him. Hadn't answered any of my calls or messages. Either the man hightailed it with the eddies, or there's a splat mark in his shape somewhere. Let us know how to proceed, okay? We need a new guy. Plus, there's an access shard problem. Whole building's one sitting duck for breaking. Is it now? Hey, Mike, this eating guy dropped by today to see what's up. Paid up front, so he asks again. You tell him to step off your dick. 
Anyway, you need to make a shard with the whole building access because he said he's got to check all the feed pipes, pipe loops and whatever else. I don't know, could take hours. Thanks in advance, Jim. Okay, let's have a look at this uh, quest. Gig type search and recovery. Retrieve Leah's Golden's Lockbreaker device. A giant treasure can turn out to be a great curse. Remember that, V. One of the fences in my territory, Leah Gladden, came into possession of some highly valuable equipment. A lockbreak device capable of jailbreaking core cyberware, or some call it corp cracker. This tech opens doors for suits who want out but don't want to lose function of corp issue chrome or are looking to make an extra eddy by selling second hand. Leah wasn't born yesterday, she knows what the tech is worth. She and I went back and forth, long price negotiations. We were close to reaching a deal when all contact was lost. Your job is to find out what happened to Leah, but more importantly to get that skeleton key for me. Don't bother reporting back until you have it. Don't waste my time. Okay. Not some squatting, there's no point squatting. And he's got a key on him, has he? Oops. Now him I meant to kill. Okay. Elevator's locked. See what's in here, shall we? Okay, messages free. Radiator guy, yes, we've had these along with junk mail. Well, it's a bit late to be putting them in the trash. I feel. I could get through using my tech. I don't think there's any cameras about. Okay. Looking good. For the love of. Uh, couldn't I have been stuck in some model skull? Or I don't know, a fucking landscape architect? What is it now, Johnny? Being dragged through roach infested flop houses again. That's what. Hey. Job's a job. Now, what was that code? Enter code 2137. Optional. Well, that makes it easy. Use 2137. What a fucking shit style. I know, right? It Slumming it in squats like your whole thing? Sure, when I was scared out beyond all recognition. I mean, at the end of the day, these max stocks, if I don't use them, they're good mats for crafting some pizza. Okay. Oh, damn roaches everywhere. Oh, well, well. Secret doors. How cliche. I know, right? Why do peeps have to be so goddamn predictable? I <laughs> yeah, like everyone's got sliding vending machines, secret doors in their apartments predictable Ooh, oh that's a nice looking overture I do like the look of that one I'm gonna be keeping that and upgrading it for sure what's this archive conversation between Wilbur and Leah Leah's the girls whose apartment this is 
Hey Leah. Hey. So, got any eager buyers? Yup, tigers. Triple my asking amount. Sounds good. Too good to be true. Jealousy subtle. All cause I'm fucking filthy rich. Bet your sweet ass I am. But that won't change the facts. This reeks a mile off. In your shoes, I'd rather stick my finger up a cat's asshole than touch this deal. I mean, yeah, all right, 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 right. Got a call. Call you from Hawaii. Knock. So I'd rather do that. Well, your choices. You know, people like doing all sorts of things. And it's good. I'm healthy, I don't know. But, you know. Let's have a look what messages we have. Delivery. Vendo, mate. Nice city vending to Leah. Good day, your order is ready for pickup. As requested, steel wheels have been mounted to the bottom of your machine. Please remember that the maximum wheel load capacity is 2,200 pounds. Using the wheels to support more than the specified weight may result in damages. If you have any questions or concerns, do not hesitate to call. Scam alert. Okay, well that's a no. Stop complaining, get rich today. The first and most important lesson, you and only you are responsible for your situation in life. Don't wait for the government to take pity on you. Don't wait for your loved ones to lend a helping hand. Just pull yourself up by your bootstraps and get to work. I know what you're going to say. Unemployment is at 34%, but so what? What's stopping you from starting your own business? It's that damn simple. What's that? You say you need an education? So educate yourself for Christ's sakes. From now on, I don't want to hear any excuses. What matters is that you can be rich too, but you have to want it. And for that, you have to work for it. Yeah. The, the, the dream that keeps you oh, striving. Oh, it's about to push pushing buttons. Must be connected to those doors. Or a shitter flushing somewhere. Who knows? Yeah, or that could be. Who knows? Thanks, Johnny, for your enthusiasm. Ooh. What do we have here then? We have health. These were always worth about seven hundred and fifty. Whatever was in these boxes when I first started playing in January, now 150. Here we go. From Lair to Akedo. Make sure you're holding on to something because I got something that'll make you fall out of your chair. I've got a pretty piece of tech for sale that jailbreaks corporate equipment. 100% effective on both implants and weapons. Works across the board except for Nightcore tech. Must use another, except for Nightcore tech, must use another encryption system. Interested? Don't think too long, I have other buyers. Wakado Wakado. I'm buying. Send details on payment and delivery. Looks like Leo went to the Tiger Claws behind Waco's back. It does, doesn't it? Tisk tisk tisk. Claws aren't the deal on her in type. Let's see if she got lucky. And with Keiko Okado, she has very many husbands. I wonder how she feels about cheating. Probably not very well. Kana, got something for you. A device for jailbreaking corporate equipment. 100% effective on both implants and weapons. I mean, she just sent out spam email to everyone claiming they've had this. Holy shit, I'll give you three times more than the best offer. Drop by wired head and we'll hit the market. Okay. The wired head. Oh, we're changing you. News. We have news. Lucas Rhymes has died. Night City bids farewell to its mayor. Lucius Rhyme died in his sleep due to a cardiac implant malfunction. Rhymes' name will go down in the history books for his heroism in defending Night City against the Nusa forces led by President Myers. Sabu Arasaka is dead. We sincerely regret to inform you that the long-time CEO of Arasaka was murdered at the tender young age of 158. He must look a lot like uh, Rupert Murdoch does at the moment. moment. All of Japan is mourning the untimely departure of a man who spearheaded the development of his homeland for nearly 150 years. 
Okay, then we've got the old news, which we've already seen. That was interesting. Wonder if um, the other news, NS54 news, is on there as well. Should we see what that does? Mayor Ryan Saburu, Saburu, Saburu Arasaka murdered. His son Yaranobu blamed Arasaka's competitors, the Militech, for the longtime CEO's murder. Gotcha. Mayor Ryan has passed away. Though the news is sad and unexpected, it presents Nice City with an opportunity for change. Some of his closest colleagues said of Ryan that he always wanted the best for Night City, but wasn't always prepared to take the right decision. His alliance with Arasaka is... Ah, so... Mayor Ryan and Arasaka were in cahoots. But it sounds like Arasaka's power is in dissidency at the moment. The NCPD breached the home of an Arasaka employee who hadn't been seen for two days. According to colleagues, officers discovered the man's body, with the official rip doc noted the cause of death as suicide by poison. Disgraceful work conditions have been widely. They need suicide nets. Many places in the east, in the apple factories in the east, they had to put up suicide nets because the workers prefer to jump than uh, work for Apple. I don't know why. You'd have thought they'd jump at the chance. Well, I never got the shard, so we're just walking out of here, I guess. I don't think I've pissed anyone off. Okay. Well, that was painless. Where's this? Oh, that's all the way down there. And we'll come to that later. I think I was planning more on heading this way and uh, having a look at Wellsprings. I thought maybe we could end with uh, the Dalamain cab driving back. That one's Norfolk, which I'm sure you don't want to see. That's so actually you've got to drive carefully and slowly just back to the Dalamain place. So I thought I'd do that last. So let's uh, let's see what this one's about, shall we? How far is it? 400 meters. That's time for our bike. Here we go. Rope. No, don't kill anyone. Yep, straight up here. Police, I'm not interested in that at the moment. We're doing this gig. We're gonna do. Child, I have a grave task for you. The literal kind. The net runner is still alive, but what happens to her is either a matter of time or your discretion. I hear you. Bugbear is trapped in the net. If she jacks out, the tiger claws stand ready, I hear you. waiting like vultures to tear her to shreds. And if she doesn't, her synapses will fly soon enough anyway. I am counting on you, V. See the details attached. Do you know what's tempting? To kill him right there. To jump across from that roof over there. I could be in and out and no one has to know. I can't see any other bods over there. I mean, I'll save this because sometimes if you're out of the area, you end up getting the police after you. I know. Yes, we're all gone. I didn't like that. I think I'll hang on for a minute. Considering renting or purchasing a cheaper for yourself or a loved one, get in touch with the administration or no other call of air.
Come on in the head, we've got to get them right. Gotcha. Well, ain't gonna give me and another good shot. Hang on. What the hell's going on with his face? I blasted most of it away. Oops. Okay, well that went well. Let's see what's in here. Got no home, sick kid and cheated wife. Need booze money as soon as possible. You're just going to waste it anyways. Yeah, that's true. Never begrudge a homeless person some booze, for fuck's sake. Ever. I mean, how long did this go on? What's it gonna change? Yeah, but then we... Okay. Make sure downstairs is clear. I don't want anyone behind me, you know? I'm so clumsy. God damn it. Is there anything I haven't knocked over? Okay, this is just leads out to the exit. That's good. Ah, oh, I hate what's in here. Yo, ah, oh, it's a balcony. Okay. Interesting. Doors locked. Well, we know there's one guy in there. Okay. Let's have some of this food. Money. You leave so much. Money laying around. Most welcome. The Solo's Manual by Morgan Blackhand. Have I read this? I don't remember. Think you've got it what it takes to be a legendary solo, huh? Sure you do. Otherwise, why pick up this book? You're looking for respect, for fear, for a way to be on top. Maybe you heard someone quote me about winning battles with only a glance before a single shot's been fired. Well, fine. I'll let you in on the secret. It is possible and you can do it too, but only if you've got the guts to survive, go into hell and back more times than you can count. Thousands of fights, millions of bullets, hundreds of gallons of blood, including yours. That's what you have to look forward to, and you'll need a solid ripper. I have read this, so I'm not carrying on with reading this again. However eloquent, <laughs> however much I enjoy reading. Okay. What about this door? That needs force. I bet I can get there over the balconies. Let's try. Oops. Can I open it? Nope. Is this open? No. Ah, uh, so unfair. Who are we supposed to believe, huh? That runners I know, right? together. Had a Come on in. Good news, bad news. Well, tell a lie. More bad news. Wait. Do not disconnect. Call me down, or I am. BBQ, take call from bathroom.
Kaneshi and Nakaya. How's it going? You jack her out? Gonna need more time, boss. We can force disconnect, but then she won't tell us a thing. Gotta find someone who knows how Bud Bear works. Who knows her? We got any runners who had contact with her? I better just call you. Okay, let's grab the coolant. Put my gun away. I do not need that at the moment. Military grade amorid net running. Oh, I've got to do a net runner build sometime. A wicked acid trip, but not the kind you think. Ever wonder what it feels like to fall in a pool of acid? Well, wonder no more. Before I ever even got my copy of Kings of Acid, my curiosity took a nosedive once I found out it wasn't about that type of acid. In any case, body horror had such a tradition. It's a damn near Herculean task to find a fresh angle, take on bag of acid baths, but holy shit, did the devs do it? You players are to occur a klutzy and somewhat awkward rocker boy who gets himself tangled up in a shitstorm with Maelstrom. The bald goons entrust Kerr with handling a mysterious shipment containing a protozoa capable of instantaneous regeneration. But in an unlucky twist, a painfully common occurrence for a hero, a rival gang ambushes the exchange at a corpse science lab and Kerr is pushed into a vat of mutagenic acid. It <laughs> has happened to us all. That's when the trip kicks in, if you will. The rocker boy begins undergoing constant mutations, eyeballs on stalks, shifting skin, throat tentacles, and that's not even the real freaky stuff. Also, every victory in combat, Arthur absorbs the genetic code from the blood splatter of his foes, making the already delightful hack and slash combat even more gratifying. The constantly growing spiral of possible mutations makes for a rewarding way to spend experience points and builds in strong replayability. All in all, Kerr's ultimate motivation is seeking bloody revenge against his music producer who cost him a lucrative album deal and brutally murdered the rock boy's boyfriend. Story and gameplay are gen gen geniusly intertwined and the pseudo brain dance implant shipped with each game copy really helps the most players in the utterly fucked mutations where searing pain turns to power jacked ecstasy trust me you don't want to miss out on this one I hear you yes. yes. 276 Beasley dollars honestly okay by the bear. Disconnect bugbear. System temp. Ooh, reduce user done that. Done that, done that, done that. Alarm. Okay, went smooth with the van. Good to go, but remember, cut the alarm for 15 minutes at 2.30 sharp. At 2.31, we start to load everything. Everything needs to be nailed to the nanosec. You screwed up, I shred your ass. Chill, what's with the nerves? Armoured van. You need to remote hack the Kuroshi van in the interval. You will have 10 seconds. Fuck this up, and we don't get in the warehouse. Got it? From the Ramosa. I'll have to keep out and see what happened there. Okay, let's yes. jack you out. That's what I ordered. Or can I pick them up? Great. Yep, got it. Carry bugbear to the fixer's car. Well, good news, bad news. And he's dropped you a little bit. You're not dead. Good. Get us out of here. Well done, my dear. I know, right? I am pleased. As they say, we will be in touch. Contract closed. Ooh. Level 15. 
we're getting there. Where to next? This is a bike. This is a job. Let's head for the job first, shall we? Yeah, let's head for the job. I think. See some nades going in there. I'm not doing any nades in there. What we'll do is we'll go. Come on! You see that ugly face of yours? I hope not. That's not my plan. Oh, you damn you. I got that one. That was a hit. That definitely was a hit. And so was that. You're safe, lady. You can go. You're all right. Archived conversation. Have a read of this. Kaczynski. That dealer can't say no. You fucking believe it? Here I am. A paying customer, and she says no. I can cunt suddenly all prim and proper like she's too good for me. You all gotta teach her a lesson. Wipe that bitch. She's a tiger dealer, a good girl. Leave her alone. And I'm Gavin fucking Gajinski. Does that mean nothing anymore? I said zero her. Your father won't like this. Your job is to follow orders. I gotta say, who, who you were with, who you do biz with on the side. Okay, I'll do it. But I'll come back to bite us, I mean it. Fuck it, I do not care. No, he didn't, did he? And he did come back to bite him. The animals, look at the size of her. I think that's the first animal I've seen, maybe. Don't know, didn't pay too much attention. Probably should have paid more. That was some good shooting. Okay, we've got the muscle top, round jolt. Tanaka, hey, can you take care of that gonk? Gavin, all the ton of shit. I already said, no fucking way. Send one of the boys. He says he'll only buy from you. What are you worried about that gonk for? It's just a few dumb compliments. You know I broke his nose, right? Apparently you left him wanting more. Grins. Ryoko, it's a big order. Besides, kids got connects. Come on, please. I'll make it up to you. All right, all right. Fuck, but if he makes another pass at me, I'm going to break his arm. Glad you finally agree. Thanks. Yeah, Eddie's. Okay. Well, that went well. Tempting. Maybe I'll ride out on his bike. I like the looks of that. Where am I going now? Rescue the person here. We've got 54 minutes. I think what we'll do is we'll head up to here right now and do this quickly. And we can come back and do uh, Westbrook in the next session. What's going on with my hat? I must have pressed F1 accidentally. You gotta look good, you know. I think she looks good. Oh, 
Okay. And we're out of here. I think I prefer my Jackie's Arch to this. This is all a bit much like a chopper. Sitting up right. The, the head down. I don't think it's got the speed of Jackie's Arch. The pickup. Straighten those curves. Get you back to safety. Garage. By driving through the streets. Hello? Yeah. Uh, yeah. Afraid so. Fine. Take me there. Just get me out of here. Let me know when I'm safe. Right you are. You're welcome in, but do take it slow. And try not to hit anything. That's the advantage of stealing bikes. Take it slow, don't hit anything. Or it'll start whining. I know if you go too fast, you know. You know, I'm gonna do the Delamains, I decided. You don't know what I mean save me at the end of the day, at the end of the heist. You never know when you're gonna to need saving again. Alright, alright, okay. One point two kilometers at this speed. This is very much about patience. This quest. Here we go. Try and keep it at fifty, shall we? See if we can get fifty. Yeah. Wow. It went into me, that was not my fault. We'll be there soon. I see it. Halfway there. Looks so good. A far wind. Only three hundred yards left. Yeah, we'll definitely clear out tomorrow. We'll do the um I can't remember the name of it. The district where the graveyard is, but we'll be there tomorrow. And we'll finish that off. Okay, here we are. Finally. Oh, I shan't be alone here. See, wasn't so bad. It was horrifying. It was great. But still, don't you understand? I thank you. Don't interrupt me. Get out of the cab. Thank you, V. Sincerest thanks for your assistance, V. I've taken the liberty to send you a share of your fee. Oh, oh, 41k. The eddies are rolling in. Okay, uh, let's sort out my messages. I'd like to leave shut down today with zero. Let's see what we've got, shall we? From Regina. Regina. 
Cyber Psycho sighting. I'm not sure if I'm going to do the Cyber Psychos yet. Dakota Smith. And drop by if you ever want to talk. All right, that was the one in the Badlands. Bugbear. Used to be Bugbear and the Tigers got along. They were supposed to work a Kuroshi warehouse job together, but she left them out to dry. Remotely drove out a van packed with high-end gear and abandoned them inside. Certain death. But those Tigers are a tough crew. You know how stubborn they are. You know how stubborn they can be. The next day, they pull up to her apartment, wanted to know where she stashed the tech. Bugbear was desperate, escaped to the net, shrouded herself in soft. Shrouded herself in soft, that's to flatline her if they try to disconnect her. Of course, now they just have to watch the clock tick. Eventually, Bugbear will have to come out or risk frying her own synapses. And the tigers are patient, especially in matters of revenge. Personally, I think they like it more this way. Get Bugbear out of there and give word. I'll send transport, but remember to disconnect her safely. She's useless to me dead. I saved her. I did the right thing. Corp Cracker. Retrieve Lear's golden lock breaker device. Yes, we're going to be doing that. And we know where it is now. Special reward. The money should be already in your account, but I have the personal. It also doubles as a tattoo. My treat. Okay, we've done that. Uh, that is it for today. Thank you very much for watching. And we'll see you tomorrow. Where we'll be taking on Norfolk. Running through the jobs, doing what we can. Seeing the sights. Grinding out that rep and level. Uh, if you like the video, Hit like, subscribe, much appreciated. Leave a comment. I'd like to. I'd love to hear about some of your V characters, what you've got in store for them, the role plays that you've come up with. That'd be great if you want to leave something like that in the comments. But um, that's it. Thank you very much for watching. Goodbye.